Well, he was a tailor. He was once a tailor in London while he was playing the nightclubs at night. His real name, Leslie Sebastian Charles. But we all got to know him as Billy Ocean. He's at number 12 on my fancy playlist, Get Out of My Dreams and Get Into My Car. I read a I read a comment on YouTube by a girl who said that she thought the song was creepy. I mean, come on. This is a fun record. There's nothing creepy about this. It's just... It's nothing. It's just the mindset of a lot of people. It's just that the littlest thing is just considered creepy now. Maybe me doing this video and talking to you on an intimate basis is creepy. Just... Just get off of it. This is innocuous. The record is completely innocuous. Well, anyway, uh, Billy Ocean. Now, here's the thing about Billy Ocean. I remember his first record. It was a very passionate record. It was one of the most passionate records I've ever heard. Man, I thought this guy was just, he was wanting a girlfriend real bad when he came out with this record. That's what it sounded like. It was it, this song was conveyed with such sincerity. I'm talking about love really hurts without you, and it was in the spring of 1976, way before he got big in the 80s. Does anybody remember the Motown sounding "Love Really Hurts Without You" by Billy Ocean? Does anybody out there, if even if you're the 0.1 percent of the population in America that remembers the song? That was from his very first album, Billy Ocean, although he did put out his first single, I believe, in 1972. Of course, that was under his uh, real name, or sort of his real name, Les Charles. He got his name Billy Ocean from a place called Ocean Estate. It's in the Stepney district of the, of the east end of, of London, and that's where Billy Ocean was living at the time. So, lastly, Sebastian Charles does sound a little bit too ponderous to pronounce. It'd be like you'd be on the Top 40 radio station. Well, we're going to play the new one by Leslie Sebastian Charles. Actually, that does have a nice rhyme to it. Well, Get Out of My Dreams, Get Into My Car. This was another big hit for Billy Ocean. Caribbean Queen in 1984, and then Suddenly, and Love Song, and, uh, and uh, Get Out of My Dreams, and Get In My Car. This was number one in America, Australia, Belgium, Ireland. It went to number three in Britain. Billy Ocean at number 12 with Get Out of My Dreams and Get Into My Car. And no, I'm not creepy.